Kentucky is world famous for its bourbon. While the tradition dates back decades, Eleanor Buckley met the husband and wife who are now the first African American bourbon distillery owners in Kentucky's history. The story sells the first bottle, but what's in it will sell the second. Like many Kentucky bourbons, the history of their distillery is so important to founders Sean and Tia Edwards. As we went through the process, we found out that, yeah, there were no African American distilleries in the state of Kentucky. Uh, there had been no African Americans produced bourbon in the state of Kentucky that were not slaves. So the Edwardses decided the time was more than overdue to break that barrier down and others. There are hundreds of bourbons out there and so we definitely wanted ours to stand out and by it standing out it had female influence. Sean and Tia are equal contributors to Fresh Bourbon Distilling Company and it shows in their product. They have now announced plans to build a multi-million dollar distillery in Lexington. Though they cannot release their exact location, the Edwardses did tell me they plan on taking their own unique spin on the bourbon industry. The fact that uh, we are African Americans entering into this uh, field is, you know, we're excited about it, but, but that's a part of the story. We're excited about telling our story. And in 2020, the story should be unfolding more. They plan to break ground on the 34,000 square foot project by the end of the year. And the couple hopes to have their bourbon for sale later this year, and they hope to hire about 25 employees.